Well, we're just a group of students from the University of Leicester. Primarily what we're trying to do is build a Formula One style car and then we get to go race it at Formula Student, which is an event at Silverstone in mid-July. Formula Student competition is organised by the Institute of Mechanical Engineers in the UK and this competition uh, attracts about 120 universities each year from around the world. The competition mainly consists of two parts. There's the uh, where the judges come round and analyse the car for how good the design is. And then there's the racing where you compete against other universities in slalom races, acceleration races, endurance races, and you see where you stand there. So essentially when, when designing a car, it was a new experience for me, so I've been kind of learning as I go. But the first stage was to sit down with the rule book and really pick apart exactly what we needed to do. Uh, with that in mind, we also wanted ease of manufacture to be high up there. So essentially starting from a blank canvas, we picked up some rough dimensions of kind of the wheelbase that we wanted, the track length, and just kind of built from the ground up really. Uh, adding triangulation as we go and simulating each iteration as we make it to make sure that it meets all the required stiffness and strength values that are necessary. Well, currently we're at the manufacturing stage, um, primarily concerned with the chassis. This stage right now, we've got to triangulate the tubes. Um, so basically this involves cutting the tubes to length, then grinding them into a profile that can fit onto the existing tubes, and then tacking it and welding it all up. And that's primarily um, the manufacturing stage as far as the chassis is concerned. In terms of everything else, the electrics are being soldered, um, they've already been designed, and uh, the suspensions currently, the parts are being manufactured by an outside company. Once this uh, manufacturing process is completed, hopefully we're going to move on to making the mounts for the suspension so we can then attach the suspension and the uprights and the wheels. And then once that's done, all the electrical components of the car are going to be put on. So we've got our motors at the back and we've got our batteries coming into side pods. We're also in the process of manufacturing some carbon fibre bodywork. So once the chassis is done, we can get the dimensions of that and then our carbon fibre kind of bespoke bodywork will be, will be made to fit. And then hopefully it'll start to look like a finished car and it'll be drivable by the end of that stage. Yeah.